Yeah. This much water, it weighs 10 pounds. You drink 10 pounds of water every three hours? Uh, I have to drink it in a day, and uh, I can only get up to halfway by this time of the night, so I just start chugging. <laughs> so uh, it's for my health, so I hope uh, the audience will understand. No, the audience wants us to sacrifice our health for their entertainment. <laughs> Uh, oh, mama. So I guess let's talk to this refrigerator. Iris, let me introduce you to mama's little sister. <laughs> but yeah, uh, welcome everybody, though, to AI Zomnian Files. We are hopefully heading to the first ending soon, I hope. Maybe. Who knows? Who knows anymore? But, uh, crazy enough stuff has happened that I don't even know if I can su summarize it if I can try. Like, or if I tried. Yeah, let me try real quick. We're a detective. We're investigating the murder of our uh, ward, who we treat as a straight cat slash roommate. It's a mom. Current suspect being her dad. Also, conspiracy theories. They're happening. We're following the logic of this like conspiracy obsessed uh teenage influencer streamer uh and this is the bad ending uh we have an eye that's a uh has an artificial intelligence we don't know this is a bad ending this is definitely a bad ending i mean i mean all endings have to be bad endings unless we do all the routes right that's how these games kind of function yeah it's a matter of how bad is a bad ending like 999 had the ending where it was a technically a bad ending because they all died, but Snake was also a badass, so, like, I still consider it not a bad ending. Yeah. It's, like, second best ending. That's fair. But, yeah, that's my that's my synopsis. Okay, and also we go into people's... We go inside of people's dream minds. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's a, that's a huge mechanic of a game, yeah. We can enter people's dreams through the Somnium. That's why that's why this game's called AI Somnium Files, because they're the files that we got from the Somnium. And the AI part is because there's an an I. We we are there, I. There is, yeah, all all the days their subtitles have I in it. Oh, and we can only be in their Somnium for six minutes. That's is it six minutes? One. Right? Wasn't it six minutes? For some reason, I mind just saying ten minutes, but it was probably six minutes. Yeah, I don't think it's ten. That's a fridge. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I love Mama. Like Mama is such a such a like a spark of joy. I mean, she's just Lala Escargot. Yeah, but you know, but I didn't want to spoil Lala Escargot for you because you hadn't experienced Lala yet. Hey, Date. It says beignet custard on the board. What is that? I think it's really mm. wrong. It's supposed to be vernier thrusters. Mama, you better order them quick or we won't be able to control the rocket. <laughs> I know, I know. I'll have the vernier thrusters ready tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I love that, that Mama, like... j Mama just humors him. Mama's just like at this point, you know, it's easier just to go with it. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, this game is just like, what would the world look like if it was just all filled with Shad JVs? <laughs> like, if everybody's personality was just Shad JVs. Excuse me, they are not all game. me. I refuse to take responsibility for Pewter. Uh, I mean, yeah, Pewter is uh, is probably. I mean, it depends. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not gonna say anything because I don't. If Peter's like some weird sketchy dude, I don't want to associate. Peter with is you. No, I refuse. Uh, I refuse. Bottles land on the counter. I was gonna say if Peter's me, but again, he might be like weird, sketchy. I don't know. He might be a weirdo. You know. And I am not a weirdo. You are a weirdo. As I'm putting on this, like this infant. How necklace. I learned to stop worrying and love the bum. 
I mean, you know what it is, Dante. You know what it is. I, I need to learn oh. that. Oh, boy. How to, how to not stop worrying. Uh, eh, stool. <laughs> I, I like the thought that I like was like, Iris, scoot over. I need to examine that stool under you. <laughs> Uh, is that that? Is that everything? No. TV. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dante, you want to watch Hiroka's promotional video? Who? 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 <laughs> no context? Okay, cool. Okay, I think we're here for Mama, so I guess let's talk to Iris. Uh, preferences? Uh, what should we ask? Uh, that's what I'm asking you. Yeah, what, what, what should we ask? What should we ask? I mean, I don't know. What should we ask? Mama, what are you doing? Hmm, just polishing the Bonito. Why? Why, indeed. <laughs> this has to be sort of like innuendo. Okay, I, I guys like don't Mama. Understand. I mean, if you're correct and they're all just me, then Mama doesn't even know why. Like, she's just saying that. Yeah. She's just like, I'll let other people fill in the context. Yeah, you definitely do do that a lot of the time. Listen, I don't want to do all the heavy lifting. Uh... <laughs> Somebody, it, enough people on Google have asked, does Benito taste fishy for it to be one of the top questions? Does I it? I wonder if fish tastes fishy, you know? I uh, mean, I wouldn't say, like, haddock tastes fishy. Some fish taste some fishy, fish, no exception. Mm, some fish taste fishier than other fish. Some fish are very some bland. Yeah, no, you're right. Whitefish is... taste like not like much. What kind of fish? Whitefish, like haddock and cod. Whitefish? Yeah. Redfish tends to be stronger, like salmon. No, oh, aren't you nice? Are you looking for a job? Iris is still in high school. How about after you graduate? Starting rate is six million yen. And oh, I'll take it. That's a lot. That's sixty thousand dollars an hour. I'll take it. I don't even care what the job is. Dante, yeah. I need a body so I can work here immediately. <laughs> she got hired looking like a like a cyber shrimp, right? That's what Dante caught there one time. Did he? Wow. 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 Great great choice. That was underwhelming. Uh Oh, uh, about Noxolotl. Sorry, honey, but I don't know a thing about that. You forgot how to pronounce that already? I'm sure you must know something. Listen, I have a lot of things I have to put in my brain every day. Nice at laws. Nice at laws. Yeah, that's how that's how they pronounce it. If I remember correctly, I don't believe you. I'm well versed yeah, in local know. information. I know all about Tokyo's underworld, but I can't say much about the rest of the world. Bless you. Thank you. Uh, about the armed men. I think they must be foreign mafia. Some kind of international organization. They would do anything for money. Nice must have hired them. Let's see. Nice, that's how you say it. Oh. Let's see. Nice it was, yeah. No, nice. It's just nice. The rest is silent. Let's see. Uh. Mama, I want to ask you something. What is it? Those gunmen were waiting for us. Did you tell anyone we were coming? That's right. You did tell Mama that you were coming. And that you were bringing Iris. Hmm. 
Well, I did tell one person. Who? The person I was gonna have you meet, of course. Same guy who gave Ren his watch. What's his name? Futa, I think. Hmm? Futa Amanoma. <gasps> what? <laughs> Pewter. Oh, Pewter's name is. Oh, okay. So wait, let me let me do that double take again. <clears throat> Futa Amamona. Did we That's did we Pewter. know that? Did we know this? I don't know. Let's see if. Yeah, yeah. Maybe. That's been in here this entire time. Yeah, because it would have said new, right? If it had updated. I don't think any of these update. But yeah. Why why was she gonna have us meet Fuda? We've met Fuda. I don't know if they know that we know Fuda. Uh, Mafia, an international crime organ criminal organization. That is very helpful. Oh. You got, got that, Inheritance? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Mafia, an international criminal organization. Uh, okay, good, good to know. I didn't know that. Good, it'll be relevant when we play Mafia. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to assume that's a real game. You've never heard of Mafia? It's like the first like bluffing game or whatever, or social deception oh. game? Oh, so you mean uh, the the all oh, like it's like 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 werewolf? Uh, I mean, werewolf came later, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, but like that, right? Yeah, I used to play. Uh, we used to play werewolf at uh, summer camp, 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 camp. camp. But uh, I didn't. Uh, yeah, I knew of it, known as mafia as well, but we didn't use mafia because we wanted to keep it. As G rated as possible. Uh, werewolves are G rated. Well, I, they're more they're they're. It's better than like blatant references to organized crime and killing each other. I feel like that's kind of what werewolves are, though. Yeah, but we never we didn't say that they they killed. We say that they turn into werewolves. Mm, that's kind of killing. It's taking away humanity. Depends, Depends on who you ask. But yeah, sorry for the late introduction. I, I wonder if it's so that specifically because we did it, didn't do it at the start. I mean, we could reload the save. Nice early enough you. in the stream. I'm Aset, you bet. Oh, sorry, habit. I meant Iris. <laughs> oh my, you are so cute. Are you a virgin? <laughs> All right. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah. What a coincidence. Me too. Could you imagine I mean, if I was like, could no, I be, I'm not. Could I but not be? Like, what is the criteria in this regard? Oh, you don't say. I mean, it's... <laughs> we don't have to get into the ethics of virginity, but, you know. But in regards to artificial intelligence, what is it? Well, that's what I'm saying, right? Like, it's it's all, it's all, it's all social. Beer! beer! What? what? Don't like beer? Is that supposed to be a joke? You say stuff like that all the time. <laughs> okay, sorry. I didn't know they were going to talk. You say? Oh, it's just, uh, it's virginity is primarily like a social construct. So, yeah, well, obviously. theoretically, an artificial intelligence could determine what virginity means to them and would have a way to lose it. Extra hooks, too. A hanger. Um, a. I barely know her. Oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Back up. <laughs> no anger. No, that's bad. I was trying to do the A set thing where it's like, hanger banger. A <laughs> set, you bet. <laughs> I mean, you need a, you need another a, one. It has to be, well, it has to be stuff that rhymes 
that the thing the, the name the thing you say is the category and then you have to say things that are from that category that rhyme with a set well i don't know so if i say hanger i'd have to be like a net yeah sets a net a set you bet you took too long though so you lost yeah i did lose I'm not I'm not an ASAP fan, guys. You have to just mentally know always every word, word that rhymes with ASAP. I mean, honestly, that probably wouldn't be very hard if, like, ASAP was, like, your favorite cre- content creator. Like, I would just have a list of things that rhyme with set, you know, are, like, just on deck at all times. Because that's all you have to do. You know, it's not unique every time. It's just things that rhyme with et. Yeah, but you still have to make the mental connection that this is fits the categories. Yeah. Pewter, where are you? Maybe he went home. No, that can't be. Peter lives he has here. no home. Is He's he homeless. Was... <laughs> See those cabinets in the background? background? Oh, Date smells them. Date, your intuition is correct. I am detecting a living organism nearby. I knew it. I mean, there could be lots of living organisms. Spiders? There's always a spider nearby. Of course Pewter is not there. Take this search more seriously. Why? Oh, oh on the table. I thought behind the table. Behind the table. <laughs> uh, Pewter's not an iris. Iris looking around. I know this pewter guy must be hiding between the binders. What is he? Uh, his paper? Of course he's not in there. Well, the paper is not pewter, though. <laughs> uh, he's actually in the monitor. Blah. You could you could you could open that up? Uh, lockers are real place. I, I want to look in the real places last. I know. This pewter guy must be hiding inside the CRT monitor. What is he, a contortionist? Of course he's not <laughs> in there. Uh, see, chair? He's, he's in the chair. He uh. is the chair. Uh... That only leaves the steel shelves and the lockers. I feel like the steel shelves still are the sillier thing. So. Is Pewter in here? No, he's not. Uh, okay, I think all that's left is the uh, lockers. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, Dude, why? Excuse me? He's hiding in the locker. Why? He, just, he has to come out of the closet. It's a locker, not a closet. Wait a minute. Uh, okay, I'll tell you everything. A pewter made our eyeball. You told those men that Iris and I were going to Golden Yokocho, didn't you? Yes, I did. Renju hired them. Renju did? Which means Mr. Okiura is in with Nice. Nice? Don't play dumb. I know you're with them. I yeah. don't know what you're talking about. I was just helping Renju. Did you help number 89 get away? How much does she know? Just answer the question. Yes, I did. It's been bothering me. How was number 89 able to escape from Metro so easily? And you were the one being held hostage. If you were helping him the whole time, it all makes sense. It all makes sense! Uh, what do we ask first? Uh, why... What about 89's escape? Two days ago, Renju escaped from the hospital. Escaped? Renju asked me on the phone to report everything about Shoko's murder case. That's what he wanted. Yesterday, the boss told me that number 89 was coming. 
Then, Renju asked, Is there any way we can let number 89 escape? I was conflicted. I thought hard about it, but it was Renju asking. Someone I love. <gasps> what? Does, is there is there anything about this in the files? That Peter is queer? Is in love with Renju. Oh no, but like, I mean we knew that he was he was attracted to men. Do we? Yeah, he had all the boy love manga and stuff. You can have that without actually being attracted to men. I mean, yeah, but like in this game there are no coincidences. Cool name said, uh, hi, be gay, do crimes. Be gay, do crimes. I don't know. Renju doesn't seem... Renju doesn't seem gay, though. He's a maid Renju's cafe. Renju's bi, clearly. Manager. And he sounded like man and women. he was on death's doorstep. He was begging for help. I couldn't say no. With my intelligence, I was quickly able to come up with a plan. You know what the results were. What were the results? <laughs> we lived the results. What are you talking about? happened exactly how I described earlier. Though, I wasn't being threatened with a gun. You were acting, huh? Just pretending to be his hostage. Yes. Did number 89 know about the plan? Of course. We discussed it when we were alone in the interrogation room. Naturally, he agreed. I imagine he would have taken any possibility of escape. Even if we failed, he was already serving a life sentence. I mean, he could serve multiple life sentences. <laughs> you really can. Uh, now what? Uh, why was Boss not present at 89's interrogation? I may not look it. But I have connections high up at HQ. Friends from my college days. I asked one of them to call up the boss. That was very vague. Cool. Why did Renju escape with 89? I don't know. <laughs> it's true. Please, believe me. Renju said that he needed him. That's all I know. Is it true that you were the one who gave Renju his watch? Yes, that's true. There's no need to ask anything else. Why did Peter help Renju? His last answer is all I needed to hear. I see. So where is Renju? Even if I knew, why would I tell you? Because you don't want more holes in your body than you already have. You can't. Why not? Date, I didn't tell you all this because you were threatening me. I genuinely wanted you to know, to understand the truth, Date. What are you talking about? What are There's you talking about? you haven't considered. I made Aiba. We know that. And? You don't get it? Date, his hands! Oh no! Dante! <sighs> now, come with me. See, I told you that I knew something was fishy about Peter, and it wasn't the Bonito. I refuse. Yeah, but is he, is he bad? He's just gay. Hey, yeah, we don't know yet. Dante! Calm down, or it will compromise your ability to drive. If you crash, you will not be able to save Iris. Not, not necessarily true. You can crash and survive and still save her. Where is she? I don't know. So then where the hell am I going? How would I know that? You acted on your own. What about her phone's GPS? I tried. It's been turned off. Then... It's just an extra precaution. Put it somewhere they won't find it. I will call Listen. Mona now. I was gonna say, Momo with the save. That's me. I'm Momo, apparently. Hey, Dante, what's up? <laughs> it's 
explain the situation as fast as I could. Tessa. Tessa got kidnapped. Dante, you <laughs> bastard. It's I not know, her fault. No, yell at me later. Right now, I need you to tell me where she is. God damn it. After a short pause, Momo yelled out. That's where the cold storage warehouse is. That's where I saw Iris' dead body. Hey, are you listening, asshole? I've got it, thanks. I'm on my way there, too. <laughs> oh, cool name. This one more question were you and Renji roommates? Oh my god, they were roommates. Only one of them was roommates. Oh my god, they were roommates. Oh my god, one of them was roommates. Uh, 3D! Ugh. 3D environment! This looks just like Valkyria Chronicles. That is not Valkyria Chronicles. Is that from three or from two? One. Oh, which one's the one from two? Not that one. <laughs> you mean there's lots of songs in two? Yeah, but what's the battle theme from two? I don't remember the battle theme from two. That's the one I played longest ago. This sounds like a Shin Megami Tensei game. Uh, it it's sounds like Trauma Team to me. Sounds like we're about to go into something. Uh, oh, it just uh, says something. Something. Oh yeah, it literally does say something. Um, what is it? Uh, Lazarus? I forget what it is in four. Oh, I didn't do much of four. Well, yeah, but I'm saying like the beginning area, that first dungeon. Like, it sounds like we're about to enter that dungeon. What? I beat four. I didn't get every single ending, but I definitely beat it. So why does it say something? Those are the guys something. Who attacked us at Golden Yoga Show. The mercenaries. How many? I detect more than we can see. They are positioned all over the area surrounding the warehouse. Each of them carries an assault rifle. Getting through will not be an easy task. <sighs> Looks that way. I'm trying to raise the high alert on the storage. Uh, there are portable barricades set up in two areas in front of the warehouse. Portable? They can be moved and erected easily. <laughs> so can I. <laughs> portable That's or the dirtiest joke you'll get from me on stream. That you can be moved? And erect it easily. I'm just trying to get you to say it yourself. <laughs> this is the same thing, but over there. It's all something. Well, we gotta check the barricades. No, we don't. The. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna have to look it up. Don't look it up. Should we got me ten say four? Oh. <laughs> I gotta check what it is. <laughs> what that first dungeon is called. It's driving me insane. The dungeon. Where? Where where dude, where where do we look? <laughs> Naraku, that's what it is. That's not Naraku. where we look. Uh, did did you check? Did you check the barricade? Did you check that swinging box up in the air? Don't let me click it. Okay. Um, I can't see it. It's going. too far. The armed men we already looked, right? Yeah. There's yeah, something. maybe we just have to check without zooming everything, and then check and then maybe something will attendees ibis functions 
We already checked. We've used her functions. And we're forced to be here? Like, there's nothing else we could do? There's nowhere to leave. Yeah. Mm. And there's no more. That's the range we got. Our vision. Yeah. Hmm. What am I missing? I don't see anything that could be selected. Uh, yeah, like, is there any way that we can so we can like make it bright? Because that, that's clearly that's what it sounds like they're trying to get us to do. I mean, that would give away our position. And they're all there is like all the armed men have the same image. And all the barricades have the same image. Where is Which is just Yes. Nothing to select. Help. Uh pull back. Um, I looked it up because it was specifically just for this part, like it's not a spoiler too much. It said above the barricade. There's something to click above the barricade. Above which barricade? There's lots of barricades. I don't know. I mean, I can look at the picture that they attached, but like I didn't want to get too spoilery with it. It said, uh, aim above the barricade. Oh, wait, 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 wait. So green tech, something. Oh, there, it's a something. It's the, it was a something. There we go. It was a something. There is a black van parked at the end of the harbor. Anyone inside? There are two ways to find out. Walk over, knock on the window, and open the door. Or you can use the X-ray mode. Uh, let's do the first way. It's not giving me the option of the first way. You gotta pull back. Yeah, and there. No, the first way, the knocking on the door. Oh, fair. Yeah, we, we can't. Oh, that's an ibis shaped x ray. That's. It's Iris. Damn it. Is she okay? Unknown. But at least we know she's alive. The issue now is reaching her. Do we know she's alive? All right, let's do this. Hold Oma. on. Are you dense? They're going to blow your brains out. They got guns? <laughs> yeah, and not just one or two. Moma. They all have assault rifles, and they're everywhere. How is this we guy like the you. leader of a Yakuza? We told you they had guns. Can tell? Even in the dark? Have you forgotten that I found out what was inside your safe? <sighs> I have superpowers. <sighs> I can see in the dark, and I have x-ray vision. Oh, shit, you were serious? I nodded and told him about the rest. The iris is in the van at the end of the harbor. That there are two portable barricades on the way there. After I laid it out, I stared into his eyes. We need a plan. Uh, 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 help me? Yeah, sure I can. But I need to ask you a few things first. <laughs> that appears to be a military-grade all-terrain vehicle. MoMA, that vehicle... That's one of ours. I got it from the army. It's bulletproof. <coughs> Even the windows. I didn't know they sold them. I thought you were trying to run a non-violent gang. Well, that's exactly why. We got rid of our offense, so we needed a little defense. I that's fair. That makes sense, in a way. That does make sense. It's completely bulletproof. Especially if you're in... A business that is very offensive normally, right? Like if you want to remove yourself from the equation, you have to have well, all defense. Then maybe the Yakuza stop being so offensive. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you can write them a letter. Uh, why, why are these numbered? They're almost never like that. <laughs> why do you want to ask three? Why do you want to ask one? Or why did you want to ask two? Um, what do you want to ask to? 
Seems most likely. So these bad guys, why did they take Tessa? The van's at the end of the row. Okiura Fishery Cold Storage Warehouse is right there. They must be planning on taking her inside. Right now, they're probably getting it ready. They've got lookouts waiting outside. Uh, why do you want to ask Juan? Uh, I was wondering if you're going to go the way of the the password in uh, Ocarina of Time, Deku Tree. Did I? I feel like I already told this story on stream, but like, I had to ask my mom to remember that number combination when I played it for the first time. Oh. Uh? Because like, it was about the time where I had to go to bed. Uh, obviously, I was I was a kid. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Uh, but yeah, I it was bedtime and I just got into that part and I was like, I'm not gonna remember this number combination. It's too complex. <laughs> Three numbers. So I literally I ran to my mom and I'm like, Mom, okay, I'm gonna go to bed, but can you remember this? These numbers. They they literally like, give you a way to remember it. I know, but I, we got twenty three is know number one. The time. Or, like I played it when I was when I lived in Puerto Rico. Like I didn't I didn't have any context. Like I was like I could understand it, but like do you really think I had like a superb reading level? <laughs> but yeah. Uh, oh, I was like, remember these three oh, numbers because I don't remember them. Oh, my internet's getting gross. But yeah. Uh, and then in the morning, literally the first thing I did that day was like, Mama, what are the numbers? Did and she, she remember? Said them and she remembered, and it turned out that I actually remembered as well. So, you know, if you let me finish the story, you would have known that you're correct. It's a very easy number combination to remember. And I haven't forgotten it to this day, which I'm sure is true for anybody who played uh, Ocarina of Time growing up. <laughs> I maybe. I definitely know people who don't remember that combination just offhandedly but i will it will probably be the last thing i remember when my mind is slowly lost to yeah, like 23 is number one to like dementia like i'll just be muttering that and my grandkids will be like what's grandpa talking about <laughs> yeah but what is um did they change it for hero mode i feel like they did um, they i don't think no i think they actually didn't give you the hint in uh master quest oh you had to just do it i think you just had to know it from the base game i mean also process of elimination you probably could figure out pretty quickly yeah especially considering as soon as you get one wrong and it, it it resets so you don't have to do all three guesses yeah so at most it takes six tries What's I can't, I can't, I can't process that. That's too much math. No, literally, either you guess one, two, or three. Well, I know, so that's, that's three I know you're about to do this, and I was trying to do that in my brain, and it was not happening. I'm like, ugh. And if you did a uh, two, then it's either one or three. That's actually five times. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, because, like, you can't, you can't get it wrong that last time, and I had to reset, right? You yeah. It. I think Renju asked him to do all of this. Renju? Uh, I told Mama, Ma, Mama. I told Moma about Renju and Peter's relationship. <laughs> uh, this is the whole Riku, Riku situation from Kingdom Hearts 2 again. <laughs> well, Moma, right. Mama. Renju was looking for Tessa. Not only that. In a parallel world, I found Iris's body in <laughs> Bookie or a fishery warehouse. I've got a bad feeling about it. Oh, you're not going to question that, MoMA? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like MoMA's just too right or die at this point to even question anything. <laughs> it's like, whatever you say, man, it checks out. Checks out. I mean, he questioned us having superpowers. So. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He believes you have superpowers. Down, right. I believe you have access to parallel dimensions if you tell me you have superpowers, and I believe you have superpowers. I'm like, yeah, probably. <laughs> yeah. In that case, why don't we go around the back? Unfortunately, that is impossible. The warehouses are flush with the water. The only path to the van is down the front. I relayed that information to Mama. Shit. Guess it won't be that easy. 
Summarize for me. <laughs> oh, what's the plan? Uh, well... While I was coming up with a plan, a car emerged from the darkness. That was made for you. <gasps> it's a heartless car! Oh, it's just... Is this uh, the kid Oda? Is that his name? It is Ansem, Seeker of Darkness. No, oh, it is Oda. I was right. Azuki, Ota, what are you doing here? Ota. What do you mean? <sighs> you contacted us. What? I sent an aisle message to both of them. <laughs> Why? Date. If something happens to Tessa, let me know, okay? I'll save you no matter what, Iris. Yeah, but you can't just get like 12 year olds involved in this. Yeah, this is like an actual physical crime with weapons. A promise is an inviolable protocol. It must be followed. <sighs> I feel like I was just doing it on purpose because Date's choosing to follow the inane ramblings of uh, conspiracy theories like content creator well he'll put his roommate at risk well yeah but that's what I'm saying she's like eh you always pull out that excuse when it's convenient wait, 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 I'm an AI to what do you no know what white lies, lies. Oh. Besides, yeah cause isn't that part of like the laws of robotics right no one is that it always follows uh it's programming or it's orders uh, second is that it always, uh, no, one is that it'll never hurt a, hurt a person. Two is that it will always follow orders unless that breaks number one. And then three is that it will preserve itself unless it breaks the first two rules. And Ota? Perhaps he can be used as a shield. And that's true, even for me. What does it Oh, Mizuki can be helpful. Uh, Date? Who are the kids? Don't call me a kid. <laughs> Who's the old man? I sighed and shook my head. I made the introductions quickly. So you're a sixth grade roommate and a neat who's trying to get his light novel published? A neat? What's a neat? uh not employed it's like a thing it's basically like a person who lives in their mom's basement but in japan i'll look it up yeah the um, you know the the koromatsu like anime like the they're all neat that's kind of the point no not but in education employment or training that's what it means okay did you hear me did yeah you not up? not education employment or training yeah you don't look very useful yourself, old man. Yeah, you're all short and scrawny. You're shorter than him! <laughs> uh, shut up, I'm not short. The earth is just big. Oh, ooh, I need to write that one down. <laughs> <laughs> that argument is fallacious. And you're short too. No way. This isn't even my final form. What? <laughs> Oh, my joints this isn't are even my final form. I can three times bigger than this. <laughs> Excuse me, what? <laughs> Listen, that's a Pokemon. Right? Low kicks can do that. I, I wouldn't say its joints are folded up. So <laughs> on for a bit. I finally got fed up and shouted at them. You can't shout. Up, There's you literally idiots. people about to freaking shoot you. They can't see us. <laughs> you're here because you're all ASET fans. Water. Wet. Sweat. ASET! <laughs> God, I hate the way he's looking up like that. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's like a. Upset. Regret. ASET! Gambling. Uh, that's. Roulette. Bed. <laughs> Gambling. <laughs> Fears. Hey! Fears. Yeah! There are people about to shoot you! Do not! <laughs> well, maybe they're ASAP fans! Alright, let's work together! Yeah, it turns yeah, out that's why they kidnapped her. Yeah! 
This is our time to unite. Let's show them what we're made of. Yeah! Shoulder to shoulder, heart to heart, we stand. Show no <coughs> mercy, for you shall receive none. Yeah! <laughs> God. <laughs> it seems they've already become good friends. Iris has extraordinary power. Good. It's working. I explain the situation of Izuki and Oda. Or oh, sorry, Ota. Here's the plan. Ota, can you drive that vehicle? Ota. It's bulletproof, so don't worry. They can't shoot you. Yes, sir. Moma, I need your trigger finger. Get on the back with me and shoot any gunman you can see. You got it. And Mizuki. I uh. What? <laughs> Mizuki, uh, oh. go uh, go you? hang out. Are you gonna say something or? I have I have a list of every word in the English dictionary that rhymes with bet. So you can bet that I can uh, a rhyme do the ASA thing now uh, with any Arth word. Although, arthropods. Arthropods. Oh, you took too long. <laughs> well, I'm looking at there's a there's beignets on this list, but I would not use beignet in the ASA rhyme. That threw me off. <laughs> You're our secret weapon. If it all goes south, we're gonna need your powers. Leave it to me. Powers? Hey, what? Hey, what are you gonna have her do? She might not look it, but she's something <laughs> else. They won't powers. Uh, you sure outlet. About this? Gas chat. Ace at you bad. <laughs> yup. You should worry more about yourself, MoMA. Paleoanthropology. Paleoanthropology, uh, Lafayette, Greek alphabet, Asa <laughs> Greek alphabet is a paleoanthropology? It can be. It's, it's anthropology. It's not paleo. Ah, uh, that's fair. <laughs> so, now you know your jobs. Intangible asset. <laughs> Phonetic alphabet, Asa <laughs> you bet. Is phonetic alphabet even? I don't know. <laughs> Alphabet's on this a lot, on this list. I'm sure I don't need to tell you, but our objective is to reach the end of the harbor. We need to rescue Iris from that van and then get the hell out of here. Any questions? You, you should just make an AI that can complete any ASAP prompt event. for an ASAT. Oh, uh, that would be cool. Somebody do that. I mean, this game is old, but somebody do that. All right, let's do this. Yeah, let's lock and load. We're it would be terribly difficult time. if the if the sample words all had like an adjoining characteristic, like pool that they can be referred to. You know, like it's doable. It, it would need to know though. Like, it would need to understand language enough to take any yeah, prompt. Yeah. So, so that's what it would be, right? You would have to be like, F, just at the beginning, it would have to just be category, right? Like, just pick a category of things and it will give you an ASAP prompt with those. Well, it, within if you're category. picking a choice, there's, it's not even a point then. You just have each one have already picked two picked out. Like, Well, yeah, yeah, but I'm saying like that would be like the rudimentary AI and then you, you, you expand on that AI by then teaching it what like uh, a subset of lists that would qualify of that category, you know. Or you start with an AI you... that has some level of like l language. Uh, what is the word? You know that 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 could do some level of like language processing already. Yeah. So Operation Iris Rescue began. Hey, look! I gotta say, are you still tank? not? All right, let's do this. It's not a very good tank. It's completely open in the back. Kill him! 
Why even duck if you're still up and out when Damn. the bullets are coming out? Too many of them. I don't think my rifle can handle this many. Yeah, especially if you're shooting. <laughs> well, they're just gonna waste all their ammo soon, so. Just wait till they waste all their ammo on the bulletproof roof vehicle. Or pull a Resident Evil 4, fine. Where'd everybody go? Bingo night? It's just bingo. There's no night. Oh. Uh, I haven't played that game. Well, good news. A worse version of it's coming out. I have a plan. Ooh, I love playing worse versions of things. Is it a good plan? Just listen. You still have that That's why I... magazine, right? <laughs> That's why I really enjoyed uh, the port of Token Mirage Sessions. Was it a worse port? Yeah. The, really? The Switch one was worse? I mean, I, the, the tablet, the Wii U tablet really helped a lot. Oh, I, I don't even know what I used it for, so... Uh, all the menus were down there, like, uh, your phone messages will populate there, like, in real time, so you wouldn't have to go to a sub-menu to access them. Okay, um, I, d I didn't notice any issues. Is, turn order, like, all of that was, like, displayed at the bottom. It was mm, chef's kiss. Okay, you can't beat that. that feels like every other RPG, though, to just not have it like that, so that's fine. Don't act innocent. Don't act innocent. Last night, you went back to Golden Yokocho. You found one of those magazines and hid it in your clothes. How did you know? Gross. It's your eye! I'm your I was gonna say, you literally. I, I, <laughs> literally... I was really. I was really hoping he was gonna be like, you weren't even there. But no, this. Literally, she was there. <gasps> Seek a way out! In any case, throw it at the drum. No. Why not? This is a collector's item. It's SSR. There's SSR porno mags? <laughs> Super secret rare. I, I didn't know there's gotchas of porno. <laughs> I can't just throw it away. So what is more important to you, Iris or Eros? Arrow. <laughs> hmm? <sighs> Iris. Good. Hurry, they're closing in. Oh, uh, wait, can, can we... <sighs> oh, oh god, oh god! <laughs> I didn't know I needed to press the thing in time! What? Could it be? The legendary? Oh... This is amazing. No one back home. Will You're be opening here. it in the rain. You're ruining the integrity of the SSR bag. <laughs> They're truly not collectors or connoisseurs. No, I think they just casually enjoy it. Date, now shoot the drum. <laughs> Now's no time for crying. The drum contains flammable liquids. Do you understand? Fine, I got it. Uh, 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 stop moving! Will he do it? Will he do it? Yeah, yeah, you would do it. Ooh, wait, that they just went flying. That was less gruesome than it should have been. Yeah, quite a bit. Cool, that got us a little closer. Pew 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 pew. There's still more of them. And no more oil drums to blow up. I'm at my limit here. Wait. Iba, any ideas? Hmm. Hmm. Let me see. <gasps> Brain blast! No, eyeball blast, never mind. 
Got a blast. Date, last night you picked up something else, didn't you? <laughs> it's just exclusive. I it's just... told you, don't act innocent. Ninety percent. Panties and bra you shot down in Golden Yokocho. <laughs> I needed it as evidence. Enough with your pathetic excuses. Just aim under the container. No. Damn it, Dante! Oh! Uh, as a gift. Can't you just buy underwear? <laughs> He's gonna buy. This is underwear. I was gonna say you gotta give. Best when aged. Gross. <laughs> oh, <Lord. laughs> it is disgusting. That is disgusting. <laughs> That's a famous saying in France. That is not true. Dante, what are you doing? Yeah, why would you say that to an AI that has the in infinite knowledge of the internet available? Like, I, I mean, I I would, I would totally make a bullshit to an AI with infinite Dante. knowledge of the internet. Okay, okay, I just gotta throw it right. How are you gonna throw it that far? I mean, you tell me, you're doing it. How? How do you? Th what the hell? They're very dense. This must be a gift from heaven. So wet, as wet as it gets. Yeah, it's so raining. Shameless, absolutely shameless. It's wet because it's literally pouring out. Good. That went well. Now, if we can cause that container above them to fall. So, I guess when they shoot the cable. when they hired mercenaries for this, part of like the requirements for the job was must be horny on main, like oh. exclusively. Yeah, like what is your what is what are your thoughts on uh, EQs? Right, is that what it was? The erotic erotic numbers or whatever. EUs. EU, yeah, the erotic units. Can we make the shot? Yeah. Then let's go. Yotoya, Yotota. Stop moving. Kerpow. Oh shit, move! <laughs> yep, because jumping into the ocean was the smart thing to do in that. Let's go. Roger. During nah, this storm, we you know, might be dead anyways. Three feet to the other direction. Also, how are, how are the people who are behind the other people, not the shooting the people in front of them. They're not shooting they're until we get closer. They're just, they're just waiting. They're just like, yeah, the, the, the group in front of us will get them. Fine then, my turn. Wait, Mizuki! What is she, the human flea? Oh, that idiot. Seek a way, way out. 